Hey, hey, Grub Gun here. Um, I'm under strict orders to show Kermit the car. Uh, the rental car that they've given me to drive. Yeah. I don't think it's green enough. Is it open? I mean, look at that fucking trunk. I could barely squeeze a, the corpse of a hobo in there. Is it unlocked? Yeah, I left it unlocked, of course. So let's check this thing out. It's got uh, that, and uh, th uh, this, and some of these, and uh, this, and uh, whatever that is, and uh, that, and that's it. So yeah, it's Kermit the car. I've got it till Tuesday, so I'm driving this one. I've got the other car parked at my parents' house. They live over there somewhere a couple blocks, so. So they only live a couple blocks away and they have an underground parking garage, so I leave it over there. I can fucking walk over there. Oof. So yeah. It's Kermit the car. Fucking Mazda 2, it says. Well, it's free, so I'm not going to complain about that. It's not that easy being green. Okay. I'm going inside to finish this video up. Well, let's get it started. I'll be back in a sec. Uh, it's starting to rain. You're probably not going to want to see this. Uh, there's a giant spider in my bathtub. You want to see it? That's the spider that was in my tub. Here's my hand in, in comparison to it. Fucking thing's trying to get out of the cup. Uh, that's the lanyard attachment for the uh, camera. So I'm gonna re I'm gonna release it into the wild because uh, I don't want to kill it. So let's put it over here in the fucking dirt. And there he goes. Dr. Doolittle over here talking to the fucking animals. Okay, let's get inside and fucking film some shit. Hey, grub gun here. Oh, fuck. Dare I say it? It's just a matter of time before I end up saying it, so I might as well get it over with. I'm back! I never go away, so saying that is kind of redundant. But I am back. Uh, how's it going, everyone? Uh, I'm fucking back from uh, from nowhere. Uh, back from the last video, which was just two days ago or whatever. It's nice to be back after all this time. Uh, fuck off. Oh. So I hope you like the footage of the car there, Patamus. Kermit the car. Uh, enjoy that. Um, Won't be around for long, some other uh, poor sod is going to be driving that green thing. It's actually kind of fun, but the brakes are really touchy on that. You barely touch the brakes and it's like you're flying through the windshield. So, whatever. Uh, whatever. Okay, so i got some shit here to show you. Um, I'll start off by saying uh, I've, uh, there's a, now I've, oh, fuck off. I've got a Grub Gun Facebook page, so if you go to my channel, I'm not putting a link in the fucking description. You know what I mean? I'm too lazy, so that means you have to do the work. Go to my channel, and you'll see up on the banner at the top the little Facebook link. 
if you want to do that, do that. You, you, it's it's not going to be a good Facebook page, trust me. It's, if I'm in control of the fucking thing, it's just going to be half-assed. So, um, prepare for uh, extensive ha half-assery uh, if you like the Facebook page. So, it's the... You'll find it. Fuck off. Just go or not go, whatever. It doesn't matter. It's it's. I'm just. It's not going to be that great. Like I said, it's. You'll get uh, sneak previews of the uh, pickup videos that I'm doing and behind the, <laughs> behind the scenes footage. <laughs> uh yeah, photos of uh, of the man behind the curtain. Is there a man behind the curtain? Ooh. Sounds creepy. Anyway, so go and like the page or not, or whatever. You know what I mean? I'm not really bothered either way. And, uh, yeah, well, there's a pretty good, uh, what a good salesman I am. So I'm going to show you some stuff here. Um, I've got games and I've got uh, uh, other things. This isn't really going to be a lot of games. In fact, I'm just going to show you one game. But I'm gonna show you lots of different items. So what should I show you first? What's laying around here? And see, this is the thing. Uh, anyone who's already liked my Facebook page, they've already got a sneak preview of this. So oh boy, wouldn't you like to be a part of that? Just getting a sneak preview of my pickup video that I'm gonna do anyway, and you'll either watch or not. So I have a swig of my tea here. Ooh, it's still really hot. Uh, I had a nice chat this morning with Conas Deloro, the man, the legend, the myth, the 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 man behind the curtain, maybe. Who knows? And, uh, you know, after three weeks of not talking to him, because, you know, he's had better things to do, you know, because, uh, you know, he's he, he, he takes time out to uh, go to California just to avoid me. That's, that's how fucking determined he is to avoid talking to me. That's fine, you know. I know. I know what the story is. Uh, I know what the story. I know how it works. You know what I mean? Uh, I I would go to California to avoid me too. So you know. So we had a chat and solved all the problems in the world like we usually do. It's nice. Four minutes thirty four seconds. Oh, plus tacking on Kermit the car and the spider. It's probably we're probably at like over six minutes now. So and I haven't shown a fucking thing. But you'll be happy to know that once I start showing stuff, it won't last that long. So, I'm back. <laughs> so I got uh, something from Nintendo Club Nintendo. Um, it's a new uh, item. It's a reusable shopping bag with Pikmin on it. It's Pikmin! And it says, Pikmin tote, attack, multiply, become snack. So I don't know whether that's just, oh, hold on, Ooh. I don't know whether this, that's just some odd translation or whatever, but it's the Pikmin, everybody. And it's just a little canvas bag, Club Nintendo fucking, where is it? Jesus, everything's backwards. Club Nintendo thing in the corner. Cool. Um... So yeah, that was that cost me some points, but I figured I'd use them up anyway. I've been getting, I've got a lot of points on there. So, but in North America, they offer you basically the shit, fucking, the dregs of all of the rewards. So, you know, it was either that or um, that's it, pretty well. I mean, I did get the uh, Wiimote holder from Club Nintendo at one point. I mean, that's how desperate I was to get something from Club Kirby, everyone. So, you know, what else did I get? Well, my, my parents went to the States. They, they go shopping down, down in uh, Bellingham, Washington, which is just down the fucking pike from uh, where I live. And uh, my mom got me some uh, awesome sheets. Check these fucking sheets out, everyone. Uh, I always say, to, I tell her, if you're going to get me sheets, get me the sheets with the worst possible pattern on them. You know, the plaid that looks like a clown vomited on it or whatever. 
And uh, I think she outdid herself with these ones. It's some kind of, I believe, leopard print that's pink and going down into purple. I don't know if it's striped or whether it's, uh, who knows, I haven't opened them yet, but that's a, that's a sheet, uh, a fitted sheet, and two pillowcases. So my bed's going to look fucking awesome. I like bad sheets. The worst pattern possible. Because uh, they always make these sheet sets. Hold on, getting my tea again. Oh, whoa, where am I going? Huh. Off screening myself. They always make sheet sets that are just fucking horrible, like plaid and fucking gingham and fucking paisley all mixed together and stuff. And, you know, those are pretty bad. I had pink satin sheets, too, she got me one time. They were fucking amazing. Satin sheets, I mean, you know, you dive into bed too quick and you go straight off the other fucking side with them. So, uh, and the pillowcases all come off the bed, uh, come off the pillows, you know. Because everything's so slick. Oh, this is a great video. I'm having a good day here. Uh, it's a good day. Uh, now I'll show you some other stuff. Um, I was at Value Village a while back. I, I showed you one thing that I actually got from that Value Village. The Guitar Hero on Tour thing. Which I'm not going to pick up. Because I'm hiding the games that... You're not supposed to see those games. Because they're for the next next pickup video. I picked that up, but I also picked up these items. Now, for those of you who watch me, you'll know how big of a Spice Girls fan I am. And uh, so when I saw these there, I was completely stunned and amazed that these still existed in such good condition. Captain, incoming message. Getting a text. Sorry. Um, I'm amazed these uh, existed in this uh, good a condition. And of course I scooped them up right away and they, they're better than most of the GameCube games I have, which is uh, saying something. I keep looking over there. What's that? Oh my god, there's something over off to the side of the camera. No, I'm looking at the stupid screen. They're the... Um, now, I know everyone's going to want these. And, you know, I, I'm not willing to accept any trade offers for these. Uh, it's the Spice Girls... Um, in concert uh, collection, uh, the Spice Girls uh, dolls. Uh, Daz told me to call them action figures, so um, they're action figures. The Spice Girls action figures. This, of course, is uh, Victoria. This would be Posh Spice. Um, it gives a little. Uh, does it give a blurb? It's probably the same blurb on the back of all of them, but uh, it's the Victoria one, and she comes with. Uh, I guess those are plastic fingernails, a, uh, a, a collector card, and some. Uh, there's a, a nail uh, file down there that says, holy shit, it, it lists Spice Girls songs on it. And uh, yeah, you can see it includes uh, whatever that says on there. I'm not going to read it. It's too fucking small on the screen. But yeah, so it's the Victoria Beckham aka Posh Spice Doll. Um, now you'd think, you know, that would be enough. Well, don't stop till you get enough, people, because ho ho, look! It's Scary Spice. Um, of course, it's the concert collection again. Um, Mel B, as uh, she's called on here. The fucking. Mel B there, and uh, the same blurb as. Uh, on everyone and this one comes with the uh, collector card uh, some removable fake tattoos that say girl power and spice and I can't read what else it says down there some what appears to be oh roll on glitter um, which is nice and she's in her famous uh, orange and I don't know what she's in it doesn't matter but yeah, there's that one. Uh, that's pretty good. Uh, then, now, you know, two? Two. Fuck that, dude. It's it's Ginger Jerry Hollywell, a.k.a. Uh, Ginger Spice. Um, and she comes with a, a keychain and roll-on glitter and a collector card. 
And uh, it says uh, microphone, but the microphone's fucking stuck to her hand. So, I mean, how could it not come with that? And there's the picture on the back, Jerry. That's a very early photo of her. Um, the side's pretty cool. I like that. Um, so yeah, there's that one. And this one I was kind of disappointed in because it's not actually complete. So I'm going to need a hand uh, from you, the home viewers, on this one because uh, it's the Baby Spice one. And uh, you can see there she is in her famous blue lame outfit. Uh, of course, the keychain that says baby on it, the collector card. But this one's supposed to have a hair extension. And as you see, the hair extension has been... Someone's taken it out of there. Now, you know, I don't know where I'm going to get that from to replace it. But if anyone's got the... Uh, Baby Spice uh, Emma Bunton uh, uh, hair extension from the box of uh, concert collection. Uh, you know, I'd be uh, I'd be interested in getting that from you. So um, yeah, so go look through your collections and see if you have a spare Emma Bunton uh, hair extension. Now I was really pissed off. I mean, because uh, Sporty Spice wasn't in there. She's my favorite Spice Girl. And she wasn't in there. I do um, already have the Sporty Spice doll. I bought this a while back. She's smiling. Um, wave at everyone, Sporty. That's good. All right. Uh, yeah, so I have the Sporty Spice doll, but I don't have her in the box. And I don't believe this is her outfit, because it might have been one of the various outfits that I had from my... Uh, gem dolls anyway I, um yeah so you know i i really would be interested in getting the sporty spice one in the box just to complete the collection so uh, once again if anyone's got the sporty spice uh, doll in a box uh, you know just hit me up with a pm and uh i'd be interested in taking that off your hands i should sit her up on the shelf with all my fucking games Sit her next to Kirby there. Not bad, eh? So yeah, there's those. Um, yeah, I uh, I actually went to see Sporty Spice in uh, concert um, when she was uh, left when the Spice Girls broke up and she went on her solo tour. Um, it was awesome. It was awesome. So I'm going to show you one game now. The box is huge on this one. It's a big box version. Hold on, I need another swig of the tea after seeing those Spice Girls dolls. I'm, I'm parched. I don't have proper cream in there. It's just uh, whole milk. Fucking terrible. So I got this at a garage sale. Yesterday? Yesterday. Um, I took Kermit there, actually, the car, to the garage sale. It was kind of nice. Um, I, I've already got the game, but I don't have the accessory in here. Now, I know I'm going to get um, Soft Otaku uh, hitting me up, saying, um, well, now that you've got that, you've got to film that... Uh, getting your groove on video. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna fucking do that, buddy. Who wants to see me fucking dancing on a fucking dance mat in MC Grooves Beat Pad? It's the big box version. As you can see by in relation to the size of my fucking head that it is, I can't actually fit it anywhere. It won't fit up there on the top of the shelf. But as you see, there's the list of, uh, list of people that is in the disc anyway freeze frame that and read it because I can't fucking read it so but it's got the the game slips into some kind of a the fuck dude the game slips in in here you can see me moving it it's like in a little sleeve and the and the, the thing is in there and it actually says 
GameCube on it. Um, and this thing really hasn't been used, I don't think, because it still smells like, I don't know, PVC. So that's all I'm going to show you. I'm at 17 minutes already. This is going to take forever to upload. I should, by rights, be playing Final Fantasy XIV right now, which I think I'm allowed to say. Uh, but there's a huge server crash right now, so their open beta is completely fucked and everyone's getting kicked off. My girlfriend got kicked off and uh, it says she's still logged in and there's like thousands and thousands of people who are fucking going haywire because the, the servers are all fucked and literally not letting people back in. So that's what the text was about that I just got. She said that, uh, what did she say? They've responded and they're still working on it. So... So the open beta, the free open beta that lasted this weekend is completely fucked. No one's going to get it. And after Monday, it moves to um, early access to the people who bought the uh, people who bought the collector's edition. So, and that's me. So I've made a character and everything, and I've been playing it. I'm at level 11 or 12, but I just stopped because I don't want to get this error code 31. 03 or 3013 or whatever it is 201 it doesn't matter what the fucking error code number is look it up uh, but i'm just kind of scared to play it because uh, i don't want to get booted out and be stuck having to remake a character again so i'll be talking more about that later and uh, if any of you get final fantasy 14 and want to join the uh, grub gun party uh, in i'll let you know what server i'm on and stuff when they fix all the problems because or follow my facebook Follow my Facebook. Go to the Facebook. Facebook fucking whatever, dude. Or not. Make make your own decisions. I'm not here to fucking make your decisions for you, am I? So, okay. That's it for me. So this is going to be an over 20 minute video. <sighs> the fuck, man. I hope you enjoyed it anyway. I'll be talking to you soon. This has been Grub Gun. Thumbs up. Say bye, Sporty. Say bye to Sporty Spice over there. She's smiling. Okay, this has been Grub Gun. I'm signing out.